A life-threatening allergic reaction, anaphylaxis, is unpredictable. It could be mild one minute, then suddenly... It's scary. Like, you can't even breathe scary. Or your skin gets all itchy and breaks out into hives scary. Or your throat starts to tickle and close scary. It's different for everybody. Every reaction is different. A mild reaction one time can be life-threatening the next. So it's important to know your body and know when it starts to feel funny. It could be the warning signs of anaphylaxis. So it's also important to know how to use one of these. An EpiPen auto-injector. EpiPen and EpiPen Junior are for the emergency treatment of life-threatening allergic reactions. And for people who are at an increased risk for these reactions. EpiPen and EpiPen Junior should only be used to help someone during an emergency. Ready to show them how it's done? Yeah! EpiPen Junior, the one with the green label, is for kids. Like me! An EpiPen with the yellow label? For bigger people. Like me. Whether you need to use EpiPen on yourself or give it to someone else, you can just follow these simple steps. So first things first, you take it out of the tube. Just flip open the yellow cap. Or the green cap. Slide it out and hold it like this. Blue to the sky. Orange to the thigh. Then you take off the blue cap. Blue safety release. Never put your hands near the orange tip because that's where the needle comes out. The needle is designed to go through clothing, including jeans, because it must be injected into the outer thigh for quick absorption. If you're helping a young child, like me, hold the leg firmly in place. Once it is, you just do this. Boom. It clicks, so you know it worked. Then you hold it there for three seconds. Then, remove EpiPen. You'll still see some liquid in there, but don't worry, your EpiPen Junior Auto Injector gave you the right dose, and it has a special feature, the Never See Needle. Yeah, so the needle's totally covered up. So you should never see the needle. Then rub the spot for 10 seconds while you or someone else gets emergency medical help right away. Call us an ambulance. <laughs> or have someone take you to the emergency room. Just make sure to do it immediately. And you should always carry two EpiPen auto injectors wherever you go. They even come clipped together because some people might need the second dose. Take your expired or used EpiPen auto injectors to your doctor's office and ask for a refill. Remember, epinephrine is the only first-line treatment for anaphylaxis, not antihistamines. So just trust yourself and do it. Don't hesitate, especially if you know the symptoms of a life-threatening allergic reaction. And I've practiced with the gray trainer that comes in the box. Because this is what's important to people like me. And me! Use EpiPen Epinephrine Injection USP 0.3 milligrams or EpiPen Junior Epinephrine Injection USP 0.15 milligrams auto injectors right away when you have an allergic emergency, anaphylaxis. Get emergency medical help right away. You may need further medical attention. Only a healthcare professional should give additional doses of epinephrine if you need more than two injections for a single anaphylactic episode. EpiPen or EpiPen Junior should only be injected into the middle of your outer thigh, upper leg, through clothing if necessary. Do not inject into your veins, buttocks, fingers, toes, hands, or feet. Hold the leg of young children firmly in place before and during injection to prevent injuries. In case of accidental injection, please seek immediate medical treatment. Rarely, patients who have used EpiPen or EpiPen Junior may develop an infection at the injection site within a few days. Some of these infections can be serious. Call your healthcare professional right away if you have any of the following at an injection site. Redness that does not go away, swelling, tenderness, or the area feels warm to the touch. Tell your healthcare professional about all of your medical conditions, especially if you have asthma, a history of depression, thyroid problems, Parkinson's disease, diabetes, high blood pressure or heart problems, have any other medical conditions, are pregnant or plan to become pregnant, or are breastfeeding or plan to breastfeed. Be sure to also tell your healthcare professional all the medicines you take, especially medicines for asthma. If you have certain medical conditions or take certain medicines, your condition may get worse or you may have longer lasting side effects when you use EpiPen or EpiPen Junior. Common side effects include fast, irregular, or pounding heartbeat, sweating, nausea or vomiting, breathing problems, paleness, dizziness, weakness, shakiness, headache, feelings of overexcitement, nervousness, or anxiety. These side effects usually go away quickly if you lie down and rest. Tell your healthcare professional if you have any side effect that bothers you or that does not go away. Visit EpiPen.com for full prescribing information and patient information. EpiPen and EpiPen Junior Auto Injectors are for the emergency treatment of life-threatening allergic reactions, anaphylaxis, caused by allergens, exercise, or unknown triggers, and for people who are at increased risk for these reactions. EpiPen and EpiPen Junior are intended for immediate administration as emergency supportive therapy only. Seek immediate emergency medical help right away. 
you are encouraged to report negative side effects of prescription drugs to the FDA. Visit www.fda.gov medwatch or call 1-800-FDA-1088. For additional information, please contact us at 800-395-3376. Talk to your healthcare professional to see if EpiPen or EpiPen Junior auto injectors are right for you.